All right, uh, good afternoon and uh, welcome to uh, today's uh, broadcast. Uh, you know already that uh, we cannot do anything without, of course, uh, honoring Majek Fashek, a legend. Uh, and of course, uh, in, for that reason, we'll continue with the scroll messages that you can see on the screen. Uh, just some little information about him. Uh, he's a legend, one that has uh, influenced the music industry in Nigeria uh, in so many ways. His impact cannot uh, really be overemphasized. So, uh, no, I will fit to talk about uh, Africa when it comes to reggae without talking about Majek Fashek. So, uh, you know already that uh, today we'll be talking about uh, the music industry. Uh, looking at it from the angle of business, uh, you you quite agree with me that uh, there are so many people who think that uh, music is just for fun. There are some we know they see them from the business angle, and that now why I say okay. Uh, even though I, I play some role and we still play role in the distribution of music or promotion of music rather, uh, I know I don't really have all the knowledge about how it works, and that is why I ask. Uh, my big boss, uh, O.C. Ashivas, the CEO of uh, Ashivas Entertainment, to join me on the program today. So, bros, good afternoon. Good evening, yeah, my bros, brother. Welcome. Thanks for uh, having me. How's dinner? Very well, thank God. I just got back from work, man. Oh, I understand. That's much more. Yeah. And rest in peace to our legend, dude. Majek Fashek, uh, yeah. and we lost a great man there. We lost a great man there. At least, it seemed fully for people who first enter mainstream for the industry. I think Simon will take us to. Also, who do you want for him? Although at the point in career, I began to drift, but it was a life well spent. He lived a very good life. Making rest on and Majek, rest in peace, man. Rest in peace. Yeah, of course. Uh, yeah. Yes, so uh, you, 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 you mentioned answer, uh, but then again, uh, uh, let's come to our discussion for today, which is, of course, uh, about the business of music. Uh, one other reason, apart from uh, there's so many controversies with on the Apple recently, is uh, about music legend. Some of those artists, and we will know many, many years ago, we in. When you go come with some time, when we'll see them, that they even they struggle to eat, you know, a whole lot of things they happen. So you go make me one answer. The music industry, na business or na charity, what will be the mindset of people in the industry? Um, the truth we say music business, supposed to be business as we call a music business. But to an extent, the relation between the label and the artist. Not the turn for the party. So they, they almost do it like charity. No proper record, no proper bookkeeping. You understand? Some they feel entitled, like most of the artists feel entitled. You understand? For instance, if you get passion for music, you see young boys have been singing. You just can't. They are boys have been singing. Come follow me. Go on, but you buy clothes for them. You understand? You go test our brother, I'm going to give him money. You are doing it to help his career. You understand? All of a sudden, you can't say attention on the door, the boy. You want to change them. I mean, one thing, even though you start as, as charity, you need to end them as business. Yeah. You understand? So, the moment you begin to say attention on the boy, you will change them. You will be telling us, oh, yeah, our lawyers will sign contract. We sign contract. Now, then you will see the boy true character. Some at that level, they will say, they don't want to sign. You forget to see the same person, don't do everything we want for you. You understand? And they listen to some controversies. Um, recently, I called the lab. I see this same person in the house. You be like me, they sleep on that in bed. In house, you for Lagos, one of the major challenges we get for Lagos an accommodation problem. If you if you get accommodation, if you can get an accommodation in Lagos, you are fine. Put no problem. If you go in the house, no, we will give you. You understand? We'll get you food 200 yeah. and you get some food for bus stop. You have accommodation person in the house, you for house. Keep you for a very long time. Carry you travel. You don't look good. You understand? Change your whole mindset about how things happen. Change your personality out there. People they look you as big boy, but you don't be. You understand? Mm. Under yeah. person shadow, under one man shadow. Then you go come back. What is the man do to you well? 
in life, for me, what I've learned in life is that whatever platform you see yourself, whatever platform you did, use that platform, go. Don't wait for the man in charge. Don't wait for the for your boss to tell you, this is what I need to do, this is what I need to do. Ride on the platform. You understand? Meet people through him. Yeah. Meet friends. Ride on it. If you ride on that platform, you will remain forever grateful to him and you will remain forever important to your community. You will be forever relevant. That's why music business, you need to, the artist need to get that business sense. Like the label boss. You understand? Nobody they invest money yeah. to lose money. Whoever invest money, go and make money back. You understand? Then these days now, we yeah, ask for this thing. The, the, the promoters of music, the promoters of music, like the radio station, television stations, they don't want to follow the record label CEO, be friend. All they want from the record label CEO is that you can promote the music, no problem. But they want the artist to be their friend. They defend the artist. You understand? So the artist who use that yeah. opportunity and get fans them back because they are friends. They call them up, they reach out to them. You understand? So that if they won't leave the label, he will still be relevant. You understand? Because mm -hmm. most of the yeah. callers are living yeah. mostly they can connect. Like me, I get almost all the radio stations on that end. I get that number. You understand? Same as the TV stations. If you meet a time somewhere, we dream to chat, to talk. If I choose somebody, they will welcome the person. But when the person begins to speak, you don't want to recognize them, but they say, ah, that your boy. boy. Ah, that your boy. You understand? They will complain. Yeah. So yeah. they need to own it. The artist needs to own the, their craft. Own it. Put a stamp on it. You understand my work as the artist. You understand because one day, one day you will leave the label. Don't call it the label because you don't learn work when you did the label. You can't come back on the complaint, say label do this, label do that, label do that. You understand? So much bad yeah. blood for the industry. So much bad blood. For first when you're doing business with you understand most of the CEOs with this so they get they get Business music that side also for us. We get other business we do. You understand? Yeah, I I, I know with you, Russ. Yeah. So you understand music that side also for us. We get other business we do. We they give us the money they put in back to the music. You understand? So if you don't yeah. respect me for, for putting my sweat into your, your craft, it doesn't make any sense. You're, you're expecting me to do everything, you expect me to go to the station for you. If they try to keep up the relationship for you, it's not going to be forever. We just move on at a, at a point. We just face our di di um, either direct, uh, our different directions. You understand? And man, the grow old. Man, the grow younger anymore. You get family to take care of. Yeah. You get responsibilities. You get school fees to pay. So definitely, your love for that thing when you put your money will drop. Come back to your own personal self. When you say, then be your immediate family. You understand? So the business, part of the business is a charity, part of the business are pure business. I want to do that pure business, respect them. You understand? We in label, we label, label always be at the receiving end, no doubt. There are people always blame the label. If the artist call you out now, go to comment section, keep the course with the label book, pass the, the, the artist. Then believe it into the artist talk. You come that stop, stop, stop with it. Attached to the artist. Forget this record executive. Now people who make their money, put them back with this talent. You understand? So calling a record record company out after you've left them is not a good idea at all. At all, at all, at all. I know the truth is that we don't have a structure in Nigeria. That is the truth. Musically, we don't have a structure. But it is getting better. But for us to be able to achieve something reasonable. The artist has to be a businessman, like the label boss. Everyone has to be business minded. You understand? If one person is down saying, You want me to buy clothes for him, you want me to rent house for him, you want me to give him a card, right? You want, I'm not doing nothing. Definitely, as soon as he leaves the label, he crumbles. You know, we go anywhere. Because if the label say, We are not doing it anymore for you, that's the end. Because you're you, waiting to guide you, you're changing the guide you from the one way start. Now the label get them. Now the label get the 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 the, 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 the what do you call it? The, 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 um, uh, the blueprints. 
You understand? The blueprint is from the label. So once you don't have your own blueprint, you'll be building for over those years you were with the label. Forget it. Blame yourself if anything happens wrong. Because you had the chance to build your own personal uh, contact, but you did not. You messed it up. You understand? So to be the truth is a truth, I mean, the truth is a record company gets a role to play, the artist gets a more role to play. You understand? First way they bring the money out, suppose they appreciate it, they suppose give up. So even get the money back, so there's another problem. You understand? Yeah, uh, yeah, I, I get with you, I understand, bros. Uh, but uh, yeah. get, they get some point, I'll be, we've been lose our uh, connection at one point. Uh, it gets some point where you mentioned already, where you talked about uh, how the relationship will first start, which is from uh, you see a young boy that you want to help. And so at that level, should we say now nah, because say uh, the labor owner, they come from the angle of charity from the beginning and they not declare to artists. So that is why we first, they usually they get those complaints about contracts. You know, they promote an artist. You know, they pay for session for her to record music. You know, they distribute the music on radio. Yet, no contracts. <coughs> yeah, I tell you, I tell you about my own personal experience. Yeah? Two, seven, 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 seven. I won't do one show for a papa somewhere in our part. Me, one of my friends, Natsin and Dauda. So, because then, only me get car, then I won't go call this particular. That's how I saw Solista. You know, say, with the urgency of waiting at the field at that time, say, I was carrying instrument, instrument, go up, go up, That sort of particular. I took him straight to Jawa Studio. I can't go uh, to yeah. the Yes. Go to the street. Go and go find the studio. My friends, Mabelos Benji and Luke Jordan. And they need us to do that. I carry them. I carry solid start to find them. I want you to do solid start to them. That was the first day I met them. They know they are around, but I can't tell the guy they are around. So it's so my boy. Then time we come, then Alan. You understand? I took it back to the house and went back to to my papa. But me, I got long story short. After like six months, police every time police are arrested, every time police are arrested, and I say, boy. I want to sign you, but I need to cross you up the bit before I sign you. Come to my place. I'm saying they move from my house or first time. We're going to stay together. We're living together for almost two years before I gave him his first contract. Why would he live together? I think most people go away for the door those things. But me, from the beginning, I'm not telling him I'm saying at charity. I told him I want to sign you. So I was yeah. testing his loyalty. I was testing his loyalty while he was staying with me. You understand? So when the year is that time, I, I give them up to time it. I give an open contract. They went through it. We can't go in family and then go through and go through and then sign. Start business. Now you think it's the same. You understand? So for me, it has always yeah, been I business, business, business. But what did they push me to do the business and my passion for the music? You understand? Because I have passion yeah. for it. I have passion for anything. Anyone that has a big talent, I have passion. I love people that have talented I love talented people and you can't take that away from me. It's natural. You know, as for entertainment, we need to sports, we need to music, we need to events, we need to movies. You understand? Wow. As we say, so we get players yeah. abroad, we will play ball, we get players abroad, we will play football. You understand? So, Solista as the first brand of Artifact Entertainment, not just the stepping stone. You understand? From the one, from the world going on inside that she was in 2017, 2017 rather, I knew that we would do other things related to entertainment. It will not be just at you, yeah, you, you mean 2007, Abby? 2007, yes, that's when we enter the company. Yeah. So if I don't get, if I don't yeah. get mine to do people, why I would enter the company? Why would I enter the company? Do you understand? So it was business yeah. from the world go, but it was driven by my passion. I'm a passion for it. You understand? Yo, oh, oh, okay, yeah, I, I do, I understand, Ross. Yeah, but, but then, uh, just as you just explained as well, the relationship started from a young 
man you see you won't help and uh, there was no contract it was just helping and mm -hmm. then again even the period as i said okay make i ask this question join you then if you respond as a record label owner all those period when there was no contract or when you choose to just help a young man on the street you see do you keep record of every expenses and make it known to the uh, to the artist even before the introduction of a contract honestly speaking me i did not keep record of those times and i'm i do not keep, keeping a record moment okay oh sorry sorry boy uh i'm doing this from home i'm very sorry so uh, the boy needs my attention sorry everyone bros go on no problem yeah okay the truth is that that period he was with me there was no contract and there was no record taken i didn't take any record of anything i was doing for him i didn't take any record of when i gave him the contract first professional contract that was what i started taking, keeping record of whatever was doing you understand so oh, that's why i said yeah. to an extent it was like charity but it got to a point it was strictly business but from the word go i told him already i said we want to find him are you ready to sign with us he said yes five <coughs> excuse me <coughs> you understand yeah so, i do true, true. there must be charity somehow the business part you understand but of course, the business part is okay. trouble. When you do charity, no, pro no problem. But once you don't turn into business now, they will look you as bad things. Yeah. That is it. Okay, now, when will they talk about uh, looking at you as a bad person? Is it a case of uh, they're not really understand that it costs so much to promote music? Because if I understand some, some of the things I understand, Recording a song doesn't really cost as much as the promotion of that music. You can have a good music and nobody will hear about the music. So when it comes to that level of promotion, are they always exposed to the fact that radio stations, because me myself are the OAP too, and I know it's not free. Sometimes when you come to promote music, depending on relationship, you drop gifts, you buy material things, you even uh, give money at times to OAPs. To DJs and everything. So those artists at that period, they they, they carried along to know, say, this is how much it's costing us to promote our music. Apart from the recording of the song. Of course, of course. The truth is there. And the truth is there, every process of the music, every process of the music of making music will carry the artist along. At no particular time with the artist signs, so they always carry them along. And the truth be say, if you promote song, for instance, you recorded a song, you spent you spent approximately two million in recording and shooting a video, three million recording and shooting a video. The cost of promoting that song, just a single, will be over four million. Uh, bros, are they with you? This is one of the dangers of working from home and uh, okay, what what do you want? Let's talk about it. You see, I'm talking to these big bros here and we have a lot of people. This is a serial discussion. You want to use your party or what? Hmm? Okay, you sit here with me like this, right? Okay, good. Bros, we are good. Uh -huh. So as I was saying, yeah. The truth is that you as you rightly stated. The cost of recording and shooting a video is nothing compared to the cost of promoting a single. Yeah. If you promote, if you shoot video and do songs for like three million, everything to shoot video, to promote the cost almost four five million. So on a single, you want a single to go viral, you go spend rich at least ten million for one single. Except you don't want to do it the right way. You understand how much massacre have they charge? Massacre they charge of, of almost one million dollar for a song or more than. You understand? To do the beat. 
yeah. and to shoot video. Clarence they charge average of three million to 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 do the video. Then to promote promotion promotion not the end. You know the end. Promotion is too vast. It's too vast. So he can decide to even budget five million for promotion. You know, go go anywhere. So those days we do Alabama. As we come ready for the round, we do Alabama. Yes, yeah. Do Alabama round. We go do Alabama like three times, three four times. Do mistake. Do this one. Do that one. So promotion is costing hell of money. Not of money. You understand? So uh, so the artists they did carry yeah, along, uh, but artists they did here. Alaba owns the two. And in the follow food, Alaba. They have to be follow food. What if the artist who are keeping the staff for hours? They follow go everywhere. They see him. Radio rounds have to share envelope. They see him. What would the press conference? They see him. I go tell them and see how much you spend for this thing. You go show him. You go say, okay, no problem. You understand? And yeah. That me personally, me personally, I was never at the forefront. I was always behind the scenes. People don't know me. You know me like that because I know what make make a uh, uh, um, um, stardom. Have you heard the column? Come there between me and the artist. Yeah, you understand me. Nobody like say with the drag uh, fame. You understand? So one person into there, I had the other person with it behind. So we are the people behind the scene. Why the artist is on the spot? You understand? So that way they yeah, bring him back to be visible. They bring him back to be visible. You understand? Yeah. Well, okay. Uh, now, uh, there is this thing I've always been thinking about. I they always wonder because uh, I don't want to really mention some particular artists now, so that I know. So I just want maybe we uh, keep it at the business of it. Is that does record label at what point did they even break even? Because I know, I know of a label where we spent over 35 million and the songs and the way they promote, about two different songs where they promote for the artist to do to, and where those money they come from at times, that they go as far as, uh, as even uh, having to talk to an uh, event promoter like yourself and organizer so that the artist go there on stage for big concert like like uh this the Bonner boy concert where you put together for 2018 and several other concerts i know some of this label they go even approach you now so that you will fit get that artist climb that stage and perform so and after some point the person stop i can't ask what the apple say because they spent about 35 million at that time and nothing really they work so that's why i won't ask as a record label owner at what point before now start to they break even? Truth is the truth. They say, eh? uh, music business be like um, stock exchange. You don't invest hmm. immediately and 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 and, and be looking for a, a ROI. You understand? You need to take. You need to be patient. You know, except for a very few artists, they just come out, come there everywhere. But for instance, Rema. But Emma, we don't yeah. know the background for some time, but nobody knew him. When he came out, that's it, my boy, don't know. I don't know why he ended up fully, end up. How many of those kind of artists did? The video was a process. Whiskey was a process. Um, Olamide was a process. These people started from scratch and kept it going until where they are now. You understand? So, you know, we just start music. Yeah. Call no the patient, call the. Call the I say you want time now, now. So you must get passion. You must, you understand? You must get mm. passion for what you do. Body as a label and as the artist, and you must be patient too. You understand? Yeah. Most of them they break up because they know they're patient enough. They think the label is not doing enough. But labels are bleeding. We are bleeding. We they spend raw cash. You understand? <laughs> Who oh, no figure yeah. anywhere to go tell them so I yeah, give us back our money we don't spend. You understand? So yeah, bro, I do. Business, in a long time investment. To make your money back, you make your money back. But that time when we make a bank, we don't go. You understand? Like yeah. for we, for we, for we, the content they will get now, like forever. 
when you don't reach time, when to pay you out to reach, will they give you waiting the possible is to give, 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 give your side. But for now, for now, a long time thing. Nobody, nobody don't break even. Apart from the David Do, they are Musky them and them. Mr. Is them. Now just few artists for this industry. You know, go part five artists. We don't break even physically. Well, so when they when they, they let us know now, they say, uh, for the years, because uh just to mention some few artists now, Ashivas Entertainment, for example, uh Solid Star, you get uh this this guy from uh, Cameroon, uh what did be the excellente at one time. Excellente. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, then you uh what did be the name of uh, uh this attitude guy attitude where I like it. Yes, you know. So the list that they on our own. So what did they tell us? We say An attitude. Ashiva's entertainment never even break even. Wow. None of none of those artists I put my money on where I get my money back. None. Even with the vehicle where they involved, you know, because We let not even talk about that. Wow. We don't even talk wow. Okay, uh they get you get one question, yeah. Uh, I be one ask another one, but since we did talk about breaking evil now. Uh, this question, as you see on for the screen now, uh, what happens if an artist doesn't break oh. even after spending so much on the artist? Who go bear the cost? Of course, the label. That's why we you, you see the question. question. Yes. What happens if an artist doesn't break even? Yeah, the yeah. label, of course, go bear the cost. The label, the label will bear the cost. That's why we are businessmen. That's why on most of the contracts, they say the rights of ownership of content belong to the label. So that if you never break even, yes. so they sell your music much more. Then if God come here, the artist only leave, you can't go the time in blue. People can't come back, come to see some old music. You can still make your money back, one way or the other. Okay. okay. That's why we label, we label it. Yeah? We don't pay for any artist that phone. You know why? Especially those ones that were once signed to us. Because we we'll get their content already. If they fall, the more they go down, the more they decline, the more people will buy their content. But the moment they pick, yeah. after they don't leave you, those old content will pick you. People go visit their old content. So we, now win-win for us if the artists don't see that pandemic us. It's a win-win situation. You understand? So me personally, we don't, we, we don't pay for any artist's downfall. We want the best for the artist. That's why at the point when my, when some start contract, and at the point, in the even send songs to me, they say, ah, Baba, listen to this song, listen to this song. Because the artist really is saying, not really choose music when you're supposed to live. Pass people they listen to the music. You understand? Especially we will get passion for music. I can tell you this song is a good song, that song is a bad song, this song won't go anywhere. And they talk um, even to face, me and face again, the record song, the record finish, I listen to Atlas Baba, you need to be better. Way back, don't be today. Way, way back. I'll say about this this thing no enter, I'll do them again. Do this show, do that one. You understand? Most of the artists that have relationship with, I tell them the truth. You understand? I know the fully that you are good. You understand? So when they do the work, we work till yeah. we get them proper. We go to the airport, you get one. So we can push out there. You go enter. You understand? When somebody start brought Kibo to me at, for, for, for the first time, Kibo. I for first I come my house. Yes, Kibo. Like, yeah. I just do one song. One year, one year the song. When I enter in car. I don't know I don't know uh, I, I've been just a make an act since even they talk about praying for the artist to continue to grow. Now, when it comes to, uh, because before now, una depends on people buying CDs and everything. But now we are not talking about CDs anymore. When they talk about so many streaming platforms and services online, and majority of these uh, platforms, then you have to pay for the music. Whether on iTunes, whether on Spotify or anyone, you get to pay for them. 
uh, although some they wasted a stream for free. So, is it easier now to generate revenue using the streaming service compared to when when they release album CDs the way they will print for Alaba they sell? It's more easier now. The very good to happen to 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 music industry now. The server streaming platform now it is easier to make your money back, but you still need to make it. So if you do the proper promotions, you will make your money back, no doubt. If you do the things you post it properly, place the yeah. right places in some of them. You understand? You will still make your money back. Oh, okay, so people like us because of the attitude of artists who are objectives. So, as uh, I want, I, I want quickly go back to something I just asked again. Well, because of that breaking even thing, where would they talk about now? We know, say, Ashiba's Entertainment, for example, you don't package so many concerts. Uh, this now one, uh Ola Midday Life in concert, uh, Bonner Boy Life in concert, you know, even uh, David Doe, uh, 30 BG concert, and so many other concerts, then like that. So, putting a concert together and promoting an artist, which one be better business for Shiva's Entertainment? For me, as a businessman, I would prefer, I prefer events any day and time. Because event actually they put you, they get. Okay, you understand? Yeah. Even even the for very first first event they all do. What would you and Igor show for for Golden We still break even. We broke even. You understand? What would you mean music festival? We still broke even. You understand? Event has never been. We never lost anything for event or on events because we the most time we don't get focused. Module of our promotion, we don't we always at least break even. You know, we did all of the only one, only two, only three, all the uh, massive. You understand? We do uh, the video 30 BG. You know the story already. That is the highest growth yeah. cost of ever in a co hotel. Ever in Nigeria, I know we were a co hotel. The highest growing concert ever. Nobody don't break that record 2017. 2018 we did Bonner Boy. 2018, then 2019 we did yeah, we did um, um, Daniel, Two Face, Latan, yes. and we are partners with the people that brought in future the international artists. You understand? Wow, wow, in interesting. Because uh, at at some point, so we've been, we've at been some point, this, we've like... been on this for a very long time, and I have learned on this job. You understand? I don't learn on the job. You understand? So me, I they choose my fights carefully. Instead of me to put money for artists, they get promote artists. I rather promote the artist to do event. Then on the day of the event, after the event, we we share money. Everybody go in separate ways. So I prefer that business aspect of it. Events. You understand? Yeah. No, so I'll call it that. Oh, okay, so uh, on when will they talk about that event now? Because I know, say, uh, some of the contracts on uh, labor and artist relationship, uh, some day will be 30, 40, 50, 50, 60, you know, 30, 70, and the rest. On events, now the same ratio you they use with artists, then it depends on the artist, it depends. Okay, okay. The smart ones, they partner you. The smart ones, mm. they partner you. The partners, the ones where you know nobody, you may pay them off. So, for the smart ones, they partner. So, every event we don't do, <laughs> we be smash it for a quarter. The artist was a partner. You know, just come come on board, we pay money go. You understand? So, they were partner yeah. in the event. You understand? So that way, the day is there in the own events. You understand? Like David, David, we actually didn't promote anything like that. We were just doing underground promotion. David promoted this event himself. Even yeah. on the day of the event, he was still calling me for tables. 
You understand? He owns the he owns the event. You understand? Olam the same thing. Yeah. Wisdom being Olam the post. No matter how small the act, Olam the post and perform, performing, performing, performing. No matter how small that artist be, in get a circle of people who buy ticket for farm. You understand? So who just yeah. took say I I only push I only put uh, the big big artist. No, bring every artist come your platform, sh showcase them, say they want perform for promotional sake. Then if space for them, make them perform. You understand? So people yeah. with me I don't work with, who I would like work with again, Davido. Or Lamide, any day, any time. If you're coming now, 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 I would say no, I want to work with them over and over again. Because they own their stuff. You understand? They're the food body. Hmm. No, no, not be not be like those ones that we go just I make and say. Yeah. You understand? Oh, okay, okay, bros. Now nah, uh, maybe we go for yeah, I, I say I understand what you talk. They say not be like those ones where we we'll just leave the whole matter to you and say they don't pay me off your whether they make money or they not make money, not concern me. Make a test of make a test of which we which we before the first solar in 2014. I meet one of my new products. I told him, see, I have this template. We can make it happen. Apart from two things and two points. Yeah, Let's do yeah, this. Yeah. You know what he told me? He said, OC, pay me money. I said, No, I don't want to pay you money. Look with your partners. I will pay you. When I go, I will pay you. I will stand back for the people. They will share a profit after I don't come on the phone. I said, No, you I said, Okay, no problem. I called the other artist again, other artist, other big artist, English artist again. And that's why you are what could you do this thing? That one cop price, say, no this amount, you know go do. I didn't want partner, you want pay off. I said, okay, no problem. The next place where I go meet was Olamide. I wake up from my house, 7 a.m. in the morning, just Olamide's house in Magodo. That morning, I let me wake up from sleep. Me and talk back. One of my partners, my former partner. Wake up from sleep, Olamide came out, we sat down, and we told him, Olamide, this is what I want to do. What do you think? Do you know what he said? He said, I'm in. He first told me talk. He said, I am in. Let's do this. You understand? Mm. Me, you know, who spent 10 minutes, we agreed. Immediately, immediately, work begin. Came out successful. As we finish, I said, okay, we'll see. We'll go again on this second year. I said, why not? Let's do it. We start to push only two again. I should have finished all the three. We have no time. You understand? That is the kind of approach me I want, the kind of mindset I want. I want, if you're doing anything, do it 100%. Go in, go all in. You understand? No, the no, the day. Enter, do I'm well. You understand? Okay, so. Uh, Same as David. Yeah, oh, ordinarily. You I tell you what, you what, you when I they do only three, after only three, I can't say, okay, we don't do, we don't conquer Olamide territory. This only one, two, three, do okay. We need to add somebody else. Immediately, I took my phone, I WhatsApp, I, I DM David. He didn't say my phone like this. I sent him a DM. I said, David, this thing we'll do with Olamide, we can achieve the same pitch with you. Yeah, you can be doing it. He now replied, he said, ah, I'm ready, I'm ready, I've been thinking about it. Let's do this. We'll be doing it yearly. That was what brought about a, a 30 BG concert in 2017. 30 BG, yeah. Now, DM, we don't need to do anything. Yes, DM. Now, we're going to conclude before we begin fixed meeting, begin do, begin plan. You understand? As early as June, no time for that. Time for preparation where on it like there was no tomorrow. So, for this with the event, table would also hold out. Everything also sold out. All We're already smiling. We're already smiling already. Just wait for the day of event. May come or do I event. Yeah, everybody don't know when they enter everybody pocket already. My brother. Yeah. Very easy. Very easy. Okay. Uh, so, bros, I, I know the people when they listen to us will definitely expect we will talk about this one. 
uh, the COVID-19 don't come, you know, a lot of things not really happen as, as it be before now. So uh, how, much, how much you think, say, it will affect the future of events for Nigeria? Personally, I don't think we will get any blockbuster events this year again. People be careful. Be very, very careful. You understand? They don't sell the fear with themselves too plenty. You understand? People have been have been told a lot of things about coronavirus, the coronavirus that our mindset not twist our mindset somehow. So this year, I don't think it's more why it's applying the events. But from now to September, we we'll determine. Maybe the the brain wash them, brain wash people feel don't come on. I don't talk to no coronavirus, so don't get it twisted. No, I know, I'm, I know. I'm, I, yeah, yeah, I, I I'm only you. saying, I'm only saying the, the way media take this corona, COVID-19, 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 COVID-19. Now, uh, Floyd, George, don't die. George Floyd, don't die. They don't leave COVID-19 in office, yeah. George Floyd. Abby, people don't gather. Yeah. Parties, everybody gather. No more gather. No more social distancing. Except this kind of thing continue. This time I said continue. We'll fit come out and for our head. Come out and for our head. Come out and fair part And fit come out again. Do no matter what they do. Besides that, honestly, I don't, I don't see anything happening this year. Maybe from 2021. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, then away from that, bros, uh, there's this thing where be of concern to most of us, especially young people like us, where they always reason. And we they wonder why, be like, say, some artists, even after a particular time when they know they make music again, no matter how big they used to be, majority of them, where we feel even, where we can't off my head now, then they go broke. Like, they go become dependent that they're not fit survive themselves. So, what do you think, say, is they generally responsible for that? Hello? When your brand is strong, okay. when your brand is strong, once you come off a radar small, it will shake you. When you don't be that strong brand, that's why artists, you need charisma, you need courage, you need the way they carry yourself. You understand? If she finish my entire life, you know if you go yeah. down. Except she finish, except then she finish. You understand? And that time when you're there at your prime, what you use your money to do? You invest wisely, or you begin rent house of 5, 50 million, 10 million for one year. You didn't invest wisely. If as a former artist or as an old artist, you're a developer and lucky, people go see respect you. You go see they follow those bank and they go in that time. They chill, they relax. You understand? But once they know say you did broke, yeah. once people observe say you did broke, the respect no they did at all. Even from your mama, your papa, your family members. You understand? The respect they, they 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 finish. So try as much as you can while you are making money. Invest in something tangible, something you can fall back to. You understand? Yeah. So that your respect will be intact, even when they do music. You understand? So that company self will respect you. Say, ah, this guy is still coming to event looking looking nice. They'll see if you call your phone, say, okay, what to do a talent on. Come and be a, 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 a guest or a come judge. and be the judge. You understand? Yeah. Money thing will still call you because you still the on. Because you still the on. But once you broke, you can't begin feel pity for yourself. That's self pity thing. Come begin weigh you down. You can't get depressed mentally. That's the end. You're going down, 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 down until you're forgotten. So now mentality oh. issue. You need to get that mentality say, I will study myself, do it as opposed to now, with money they come, or you will get a letter. You understand? So you got yeah. to get that winning mentality that I am not going to talk, I want to be able to talk. Who I am not going to be able to You understand? Uh, we will not get a okay, problem. Okay, we will not get a problem. Nobody looking to our life. Okay, I was going to ask you some of these things where you mentioned now, uh, which role a record label fee play? 
to ensure that artists will pass through them. Even eventually in the future, they're not going to become redundant that uh, now to they ask people for money to eat or they struggle to pay uh, children's school fees and all of the rest. Which role as a record label will have to play to ensure that all of those things don't go before these artists then? Personally, yeah. I had a great relationship with you if I don't go to bring anything positive to the table. Okay. You understand? If I don't get relationship with you, I must advise, I must guide you. You understand? But my input decided that you won't do, but me, I must guide you. Like last year, we did, I did, um, I did something with one of these new generation artists last year. You understand? I don't need to mention a name. I cannot go in my friend with the, the house, with the same properties. I cannot find like, tell us, come on, I will show you this man. If you do well with this man, this man will give you proper money, pay so much more. You understand? I don't have any, apart from the one of uh, concert I do with them, I don't get any other thing with them. He will be done under my label. But because I am working with him that particular period, I said, for you to work with me this period, I must help you achieve X, Y, Z. You understand? So I took him to the man, they made the exchange contacts. I said, come back if you want for the house, come pay small, small. It's allowed. It will allow you to pay small, small to you pay for the house finish. So that's how we rule. We know they just come your life, come waste your time. When they come, come act, put out positive things to you. You understand? They like seeing people grow. So, oh, okay. So for the artists too, uh, for the artists too, we they advise the artists, but now you go decide what you want to do with the money. Okay, yeah, because uh, we we understand, say artists then that they more exposed to the people than when I will be the record label owner. I know years we I know they hear the name OC Ashivas even before I see you for the very first time. So the only person where I know, you know, uh, the manager, the manager, solicitor, then uh, what will be this bros then? You know, so those people and the artists then I will be even the see more and even the general public. Yes, yeah. Kabiru, so but okay. you the the, the, the label the uh, yes. The, the record label owners, they're not there in the face of the people like that. So, the artists then, some of the things where they see them, whether they brandish, na expensive lifestyle. This expensive lifestyle is the way artists they showcase. It gets a way it takes they contribute to their income to increase sales and even money where they go make. The entertainment industry itself now make believe industry to an extent. I know we start them. You understand? Most of the things yeah. they do, the mirror what they have for America, for the copy them. You understand? Now make believe industry. You understand? Now pick it until you make it. But the truth is, <laughs> why do they fake them? And they make them. They make them. So now they fake the people. You understand? There are several things I did for a particular artist I worked with that I regretted. I said, you see, I know. He say I know. He say I know, because it's not affecting him. He wants to, wants to be the same like that. You understand? Mm -hmm. The of my friends yeah, is yeah. to do the new thing. But the truth be said, if they package you like that, you try package yourself. You understand? By the packaging, they bring the money. You understand? Don't you say carry one, two, three, two, one. One bank. Everybody want to follow the picture. The man, the manager of the bank, or the MD of the bank, even the head of his bank, he will see for camera. You understand? They see for CCTV. I will see who is that guy. That's not, that not, uh, yeah, yeah. that not this artist. Not this artist. Because if one thing wants to see you, you can make them for yourself. If you fake it until you make it, or fake it until whatever happens to you. You, you, to you. you become so completely just make sure fake. while you're faking it huh? in your head. Be real, be real in your head to an extent. You understand? Yeah. Make it end for packaging. Oh, okay. Do what you're supposed to do. Okay, uh, this, this other question about the. Uh, I go take me back to something where you don't mention before. See, uh, most people where you know, most record labels, they never break even. And you even mentioned as Shiva's Entertainment that uh, Nadia. Uh, organizing and uh, promotion of events 
now you now even they bring money for you are not promotion of artists so not be every label get side also or every label owner get side also like yourself and one of the common thing we they hear for streets we say now fraud some label owners and artists then say they make their money and not from music Don't talk finished. Yeah, uh, yeah. So, I, I, how much of how much yeah how much of that be true? Saying uh, from fraud yeah. that they make their money and not even the sales of music or the uh, performance of music. Well, me, I will speak for myself. I don't know for that. Yeah. I don't begin work. I don't begin working for Lagos since 1996. 1996. I've been hustling in Lagos. It's 96. I never work for anybody. You understand? I never work for anybody before. Yeah. I don't do manual jobs. I don't do kind of work one value. I don't do tally clock inside ports. I don't do I do the work for you bust up. I don't do which I never do for East Lagos. But growth they organic. As I do those who I do, I grow small, 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 small. Yeah, my breakthrough came in early 2000. My friend, one of my fat friends. Come, come oil industry, then get plenty trucks. But we're going fast, you know, they mobile. So, fortunately enough for me, reach out, say, okay, OC, come now, we could begin to do this thing together. That was when my big, I, I made my first uh, breakthrough. You understand? I begin full of money, yeah. move around that, for Nipo, AP, Venom uh, oil, I did go everywhere oil, can be put the Ibadan, we can get one. You understand? So I had I I had control of over thirty trucks. So the whole business, I mean the control mm. tankers. So then I might be able to come from. But before then, I don't be holding for street. I don't get that people from what I was supposed to be now, what I was supposed to be. You understand? I was already prepared for anything that will happen. If I happen to be a billionaire today in dollars, I am prepared for it. You understand? So for me, for me personally, no fraud, no nothing like that. That's pure hustle. So mm. I will speak for myself. I know we speak for others. Uh, I, I I like what you do there, bros. You not talk say the fraud not did the industry. Uh, I like what you did, but of course, uh, now every now every industry get fraud even. Even radio way with this, eh, and everything way they do. So, fraudulent individuals they everywhere. So, uh, no, no, we are saying that. But finally, bros, for artists that we don't leave record label, where they struggle to come back. Uh, with it be, and even young aspiring artists, where go they, where they find labels to help them. With it be the advice where you give them and the step by step approach for them to take, uh, if they go feed bands back. Um, first of all, I'll say, I mean, I remove hate from my heart. Free your mind from hate, mm. according to two face. Now on our own. Two mindset. Live high. Live high first. Because if you bring good music, people will, people will collect or will jump on them. You understand? They should be more focused. Now, the shoe where you wear. Now you see where the CEO is standing for wear. So wear and well. Because as the leader of the team, as the CEO where you be now, if you if you fail, now you fail. But if you win, now your team, the full team win. So better be strong for your team so that you guys can win together. Because if you fail, it's your failure. Nobody scares me failure with the CEO. Now you be your CEO now. So just keep your head up. Do the right thing, be positive minded, free your mind from hate. You no, know, they go back saying that these people do me, that this person do me, that that person do me. Nobody do you. You understand? Just do what you're supposed to do. Do music. Do music. Forget the grand theater everywhere Say somebody do you. No. Go back to what you have to do. Do music and be the boss. Those connect, you know, connect that time. Connect and nice. Never too late. So that's my advice. 
Oh, okay. Uh, finally, bros. As during the, just to add this one, I just see uh, uh, the thing uh, uh, during the period where a label signed an artist, the label they get agreement with the artist on the conduct of the artist. Number one, on their conduct, public behavior and private behavior. Then number two, who handles the uh, social media of the artist? The reason why I ask this question, you see, sometimes we see situation where an artist where they big, they so much you just say some things where you not expect for them to say, especially on some political issues and even beyond or, or social issues. So who undoes the social media? And then again, is there always that clause on the conduct, the way artists go to behave under a label? Of course, um, public behavior, your, your, your behavior of public, in public, they contract already. It's mean, you know, misbehave for public. You must at all times uh, behave yourself you understand then that of social media acting are very stubborn people i think solita i open solita's instagram account facebook account twitter account i open every every social handle, social media handle, social handle, i open it you understand and i know even release to ramadi handle and both things i know it's like 2013 or so I gave it back to him in 2013. You're going in the beginning to say you need to the control, I mean to the... So I said no problem, I gave it to him to control. So those things we have to do, some of them, we don't have to do so, but I think we have to do so. When I go on the team, they have to come to the field, like say, don't be part of the label. You understand? Mm. But in the rich mm. fence, in the rich fence, that is how that is going to fall, they are put out of the system. Because even I see your structure, I see the platform we bring you up. You need to still deal up below, bring yourself down. Your people they look you say big part label. In actual sense, big part label. But because of if you get sense, you need to still bring yourself down. Hello. Hello. Wow. I'm saying, like, they need to humble okay. himself. They need to bring themselves, they humble themselves. Because if you get to that point, the artist will look as if he's bigger than the label. It's a normal thing. At the point, Whiskey was bigger than ELE, but ELE brought Whiskey to limelight. So, whatever, what, how, no matter how you want to look at it, Whiskey remains under ELE, ELE, ELE rather. You understand? So the artist will never be yeah. bigger than the label from the inside. But from the outside, the artist is always bigger than the label when he gets to that peak of his career. So because the label is supposed okay. to be behind uh, the scene, artists now need for, 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 for the spot. Oh, wow. I interesting. Uh, uh, I'm not being tense. We will stay up to... Uh uh this long uh but thanks very much uh for the knowledge where you don't share the wisdom and uh, uh some of the things i hope people will uh, follow us uh pick one thing or the other so uh at this point ross uh what may we just uh close them already uh it's one hour already i, I was i didn't really think that we're going to stay for up to one hour uh, thank, you okay. much, and, uh, thank you very much, Ross. And thank you, thank you, thank I, you. I wish I wish you all the best in the business of uh, the entertainment. And thank honestly, you, if you, to say you. I get like one billion now, uh, after transfer one billion, give you as you say, you never even break even. Because <laughs> uh, <laughs> I know that I shop from your money. I shop from your money where you promote the artist. We don't have that. We do <laughs> you get one question why we won't ask you about OAP before like 
OAP is not really stumbling block when it comes to the promotion of music. Of course, of course. Of course. But yeah. you go try as much as you can to make your friends. Like me, I get OAP, OAP yeah. friends everywhere for Nigeria. Everywhere. Every city for Nigeria, I get friends with the OAP. That's how far my contact is long. Yeah. So as I release music, I the wave lamp, I the send them. Oh yeah, help me distribute them. Help me. You understand? The normal thing. They are to me. They are more useful. They are more of. Uh, uh, they are more. They are not liability to me. They are not uh, of any type of liability to me. You understand? They are useful to me. They are more. I don't even know how to put it. But to me, na uh, na mutual understanding we get relationship. So yeah. yeah, mutual relationship. Yeah. Okay, bros. Th thank you very much, bros. Uh, definitely, uh, maybe sometime we go, we'll discuss about how we want to get oil well. No problem. No problem. You know, say I come from Hondo State, too. So I, I think we like Jack want oil you well from like my place. Like 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 Abi? Yes, now. Don't be lying. Don't be lying. We're not direct. Confirm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go good, bro. Go good, bro. Okay, bros. Thank you Amen. very much. Amen. I yeah, that. thank I you very much, sir. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah. thank you very much, sir. Okay, guys, uh, that was uh, O.C. Ashivas, uh, the CEO of Ashivas Entertainment, and of course, uh, is Ashivas Entertainment. As you don't, you already they into too many things. The organizing and the promotion of uh, concerts. You know, so many big concerts. Orlando Media Life in concerts. A life in 2018. And of course, even Zlatan and, you know, talking about uh, the Two-Face concert they put together. So much. When you talk about Ashiva's Entertainment, you know. So interesting conversation on how the music industry work. I hope you pick uh, one or two things from that. And uh, definitely, uh, let's talk agriculture tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow we'll definitely be talking agriculture. And my guest now. People will be agriculture. So we'll be talking about agriculture from the angle of business tomorrow. So until tomorrow, five o'clock again. I want to say uh, thank you very much. My name is TB Twitter. You know, may you take care of yourself and have a wonderful uh, day. Bye.